<laughs> okay, so this. <laughs> so I woke up. I woke up today on the sidewalk. <laughs> I woke up today on this. I reached a new level of drunkenness, man. Like, never in my life have I ever woken up on a sidewalk. This, this was beyond me, man. So, <laughs> so, um, I'm out here, like I said, for one of my boys. Hit one of his friends is having a bachelor party, right? So, um, we were supposed to go out and everything. They was like, "Hey, be here by 10 so we can go out and everything. I'm like, all right, bet. So I get here at like nine. And from nine to like one o'clock, these fools did not answer their phones. I'm like, damn, did they leave me? Like, did, you know, I'm saying guessing myself. I'm like, damn, did, was I supposed to be here at nine and everything? I'm like, damn, man. So I couldn't get in contact with them and everything like that. So I just went to the strip, right? Went to the strip and, you know, I got this, right? The Fat Tuesday thing. Yeah. We went, went and got this. So. I had it, and from from pretty much like ten, I waited for like an hour. From like ten to like one, I was just on the strip, just you know sipping on this, fine, just like, you know talking to people, just seeing all the um, all the hotels and everything like that, you know, because I ain't never really just did it by myself, right? So I do that, right? And um, at like one o'clock, I look at my phone, cause my phone, I don't know, my phone didn't alert me. I see that this fool called me like twice. I'm like, damn man, what happened? He's like, oh, we fell asleep. I'm like, all right, cool. So we meet up and everything, right? Before we go meet up, I go get another one of these, which was fine. Fine, we drink it the whole way. We went to, um, they went to gamble, right? So I'm watching them gambling and everything like that. So when I go to the bar, I got a shot of tequila. Still fine and everything like that. I think I had drunk all this. I had drunk all this already. So <laughs> this is when it gets hazy. All right, I really think, I really think that it was it was the it was the tequila because we went around and we did something. We're walking and stuff like that. I think we were walking back to their room. I left some stuff in their room or whatever. So as we're going to the room, we was in Caesar's Palace first, and I'm trying to show them about the nightclub because I was like, damn, the nightclub had I had a long line. So I don't remember. I don't know. Something happened to where he said that I was talking to some married couple and everything like that. The guy left and left me with his girl or something like that. And I'm like, oh, I don't, I don't remember none of this. And I guess I was just talking to the girl and everything, talking to him. That's the last thing I remember. Why these niggas didn't come and get me, I have no clue, man. But next day I know I wake up at like 10 o'clock in the morning on the sidewalk. Like... <laughs> I was so like I was uh, you know how like they have all these bridges and everything I was underneath the bridge and they were like I think I guess it was like two elevators that were like you know on the side but I woke up I still had my shoes I still had my I had a, um, I had a bag bag still had my wallet in it and everything like that but I was <laughs> I had to buy another hat right so my hat is gone right and my phone is gone so I'm like what <laughs> so before before I, I get to my sister's house to turn on my other phone, I'm thinking that these niggas were, were like, got tired of carrying me or something because I was drunk as hell. And they just put me down, and then they took my phone and my hat. So I'm, I'm mad, you know, because this is what I think happened, right? Because I am i don't know what the hell going on. But, yeah, don't know what happened, man. I, <sighs> first night out here, man, it's already going crazy. Sir, I have a 